I have decided that I'm going to make for the first time ever a poke bowl. In fact, a couple of poke bowls for my husband and me. So I have my sushi rice, some matchstick cut carrots. I have a green onion, a cucumber, a little bit of spinach for the green veg, an avocado that's ripe and ready, as well as some sushi grade tuna. I got some poke sauce and some seaweed crackers to kind of crumble up over it, as well as some white sesame seeds. I wish I had some black sesame seeds, but I had some. My baby dropped the bottle and broke it. So now we're just gonna use the regular sesame seeds that we had. So first I'm going to prep the sushi rice. So I am boiling the sushi rice. I'm just gonna put a lid over that. Let that simmer and cook. Now I'm heating up a pan to do a little sear on the tuna steaks just for the outside of it. I like my tuna really rare. For poke, you usually use raw tuna, but since this is from Walmart, I'm like, yeah, we're gonna cook the outside of this just to be safe, you know, bacteria and things like that. So let's get cooking. So onto the fish. I am doing some salt, some black pepper, and the Trader Joe's Mushroom and Company Multi-Purpose Umami Seasoning Blend. And I'm just gonna spray a little cooking spray like Pam or whatever, just for a little oil. And seafood cooks very fast, so it's getting a quick sear already. A little seasoning here. The sushi rice is almost done. You don't have to do this, but I am seasoning it with some rice vinegar, which is what you typically do if you make sushi. I'm just doing a teaspoon, or a tablespoon rather. That's called seasoning the rice, just stirring that up to mix it in, making it taste more authentic. All right, so I'm gonna leave that rice there. So now I'm starting to assemble the poke bowls. The first layer for me is a half cup of sushi rice, which is four smart points. I'm giving my husband a cup because he's not on Weight Watchers, so he gets more. Next, I'm slicing up those tuna steaks and I'm gonna put them in. Each one is two points because that is six ounces. So for me, I'm putting in the tuna. And then I just realized looking at it, my husband's not gonna like that. He does not like raw fish from Walmart. He's like, ew, what are you doing? So I'm gonna cook his a little bit longer. So I'm gonna leave his alone for a while. But next for me, I'm going to add some of the carrots. Next, I'm adding in cucumbers. For me, I'm doing one quarter of an avocado and then my husband can have all the rest of it. I'm just doing a little bit because y'all know like avocado has a lot of points. I was gonna add in the green onion, but I decided it doesn't need it. It has green with the avocado and cucumber. And so I'm gonna leave out the spinach and green onion because that's just too much trouble for me right now. All right, so my husband's got his tuna cooking, but over here, I'm still finishing up the rest of the poke bowls. And next up, I'm gonna crumble in some seaweed crackers, just for a little flavor. Next, I'm going to put in the poke sauce. I'm just doing a tablespoon for me, because this has a lot of points, y'all. This is like three points. All right, next up, just a little sprinkle of the sesame seed. One teaspoon is a point, but I'm just literally doing like a sprinkle. So here is my husband's tuna, which is more well done than mine. His bowl is overflowing, which is fine. He had more sushi rice, so there you go. By the way, I think I mentioned this, but just in case I'm letting you know, since I just did a sprinkling of sesame seeds, that's zero points, and then one cracker is zero points as well. So I'm not counting these two items. So here's the total for my sushi bowl. Ignore my husband's because obviously it's four more points for his. My poke bowl is 12 points total. So one quarter of an avocado is three points. Half a cup of sushi rice is four points. The tuna is two points, zero points for the veg and the sesame seeds and the crackers, three points for the poke sauce. So that comes out to a total of 12 points. Now, if you do a cup of sushi rice, you're looking at 16 points because my husband had a cup of sushi rice, so his bowl is 16 points. Again, he's not on Weight Watchers, so he doesn't care. I am, I do care but this is a beautiful bowl, don't you think? 
thank you so much for tuning in for this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. I've got a lot more content coming out for you soon. Be sure you're following me across all social media at Angela Cruz Tube. Meantime, thanks for tuning in for this video. I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.